absolutely free. Local 3 News. Coverage you can count on. Look at this. What is the saying? If you know, you know. So his name is Jed, this little kitten, and he's wearing a bow tie. If you know, you know. If y'all remember Jed Mescon when he was here at Channel 3, uh, this little kitten is named Jed and Jed always wore a bow tie. So he's here with the human, uh, with Pet Placement Center uh, and he, Jed, is calm as he can be. And then we have Brooke Bourgeois, Brooke Bourgeois and Michael Weathers. They're also pretty calm, but they have brought <laughs> Marilyn who is a year and a half? Year and mm -hmm. a half. Is she about? A, is she a chocolate lab? What is she? She is a German Shepherd Siberian Husky mix. <gasps> Get out! Yes, ma'am. I would have never guessed that. Maybe that explains her eyes. It does. Oh, it yeah. does. She has, you'll hopefully have a chance. So Marilyn is a little bit excited and she's not sure if she's a lap dog today or not. Uh, but she has one blue eye. See, there she goes. <laughs> one blue eye and one brown eye. She's, she's much larger than what she thinks. <laughs> and y'all are here today though, Brooke. I know it's gonna be a little bit awkward to rein everybody in, but you got a big day on Sunday with the raffle that y'all are doing. Yes, um, our annual raffle is this Sunday um, at our facility. 5975 Dayton Boulevard. Um, we do this every year. Um, as you can see, there are a ton of raffle prizes. Tickets are a dollar. And we have some really, really, really good um, gifts and, and gift cards. And there's a weekend getaway at Froggy Hollow. Um, there's um, a year supply of Coca Cola products. What? All for a dollar. A dollar a ticket. So you can get these um, at the Pet Placement Center, I guess, but you can even buy the, the raffle tickets online. Online, in person. We'll fill the tickets out for you. Um, we'll have our drawing on Sunday, and um, we welcome everyone to come out. We'll have pizza, dessert, drinks. Let's talk a little bit about what y'all do at Pet Placement Center, because, so, Jed here was a stray. How long have y'all had him? We, Jed spent some time in foster care, and we've had Jed now at the shelter probably for a few weeks because okay. he's fully vetted, okay. ready, ready for, for adoption now. About four months old. Yes. So he's the perfect age, and he's so acclimated. He is just one chill <laughs> little cat. So Marilyn over here loves cats. She, she does. loves cats. <laughs> Loves them. Kittens, cats, dogs, puppies, people, kids. She loves everything. She was in a she was in a home. She was in a home. They couldn't keep her. They could not keep her. They um, had just a, a life a lifestyle change. But she lived with a, a cat in her previous home and loved the cat. So she gets along with everybody, um, and is obviously very eager though to have that love shown She's her way. Sweet. She had a rough time when she got returned, but she's a trooper. I love her ears. Like right now, they're both doing the same thing, but earlier one flopped and one was straight up. <laughs> it's a little bit of a style choice for her. <laughs> oh, that's her fashion statement? Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, if, is there a type of home that she would best go to, Brooke? Or Michael, you might know too. Um, she would definitely do well with a big yard, big fit in yard. She loves to run. Uh, when we take her out in the morning, that's the first thing. As soon as you get her off the leash, she just takes off like a shot. Now, some, She's completely housebroken, great temperament. Something that y'all do to the best of your abilities at Pet Placement Center, um, besides selling these raffle tickets for the, the drawing on Sunday, is you're pretty selective in placing a pet. You can't just come to you and say, hey, I saw Marilyn on three plus you, I want to take her home, right? You have to make sure it's the right fit. We, we do, we try and screen our, our applicants um, to set, you know, adopters and our animals up for the best chance of success. Mm -hmm. um, we don't always get it right, but we try our best. Um, but, you know, we also allow people to do foster to adopt periods mm -hmm. um, to make sure animals are a right fit for the home. I mean, it's very easy to see these precious animals on the television and think, oh, I want to take them home. But the, and that's great. But the truth is, it's a commitment mm -hmm. that you're making. So you talk about how hard it was for her when she came back. Yes. Don't do it if you're not really in it for the long haul. Right. right? It's something you really need to think about. And it's not just a novelty thing. It's, it's, like you said, it's a commitment. It's to give them a good life and for you to have a good life with them. When you um, 
when you have the animals that are brought into you, you mentioned the fostering that you do with the kittens, which you have to because they, mm -hmm. they need around the clock care. But y'all, then once they're in your possession at Pet Placement Center, yeah. you really acclimate them to being around people. Absolutely. You make them adoptable. For sure, mm -hmm. for sure. Um, and even with our fosters, you know, we're, we're kind of there every step of the way. They come in for their vaccines, they get really socialized in their foster homes, and so by the time they come to us, they are socialized. Mm -hmm. They just have a great time in our adoption rooms. Can we talk about that for a minute too? The fact that when you adopt from a shelter, you are getting a pet that has been fully vaccinated mm -hmm. uh, and cared for. That's a lot of cost savings money mm -hmm. to the adoptee. Absolutely. I mean, our kitten adoption fees are $100 inclusive of spay and neuter, microchip, all vaccines. You know, combo tests for diseases, D more everything. It's everything. All, all included. I mean, that's multiple hundreds of dollars if you did not have that. Can I just point out that I'm just now noticing his tail? <laughs> Look how beautiful he is. <laughs> you are one fashionista kitten, Jed. He is. Oh my gosh. Um, if here. people want to get a raffle ticket, do you really want them to come by or is it better to get it online? Is it easier for y'all if they get it online? Honestly, it, it, um, it's, it's it's either or. It's whatever has many as we're long fine as we either get them way. sold and it's, we're we're completely fine either way. Yeah. We've had both people come in person and fill them out online. I mean, and and buy them online and and there's no limit to how many you can purchase. Mm -hmm. No limit. Nope. Okay, so if you want to throw down a hundred bucks, oh yeah, you'll have a hundred chances times, yeah. to win. Um, and you'll know that you're giving back to what they do at Pet Placement Center because these animals would not be these cute, adorable things that you're looking at on the show today if it weren't for the love and care y'all can give them. Well, we when appreciate in that. Need. Yeah. And like I said, you know, we are, we're China's oldest no kill facility. And so we don't receive any kind of government or city funding. And so everything that we do is <clears throat> um, donations, grants, and all this. So, any, any amount that we can raise from this raffle directly benefits the animals under our care. Well, you picked two good ones to come and well, see Marilyn's you. calmed down she, already. She has some. <laughs> she's, a, she's about to get hyped up because when we're through talking, we're going to head into that newsroom and there are going to be about 20 people who are going to go, oh, yeah, and, she'll, and she'll love it <laughs> and she will be in hog heaven. Okay, so get your raffle tickets while you can. Like they're telling us repeatedly, you can go by right there on Dayton Boulevard. You can also call them. 877-0738 or petplacementcenter.com. Those are your ways to get your raffle ticket. The drawing is at three o'clock this Sunday, um, but it, the fun begins at one. Oh, what a great job we have. Thank you, Marilyn and Jed. Thank you. Thank you guys so much. We appreciate it. At Chattanooga Mobility, we have toilet risers and sheep at pads. But don't forget your power chairs, scooters, and rollators, and all these items at great prices. But definitely don't forget to ask about our stair lift. Let us lift you to independence, Chattanooga Mobility. Hi, I'm Aaron Dixon with Insurance Advisors. Do you feel like you're